Um, so um, I'm from Japan. Have we got anyone from Japan tonight? No. <laughs> because all the Japanese are still at work. <laughs> so I've been living in this country for 11 years. 11 years now, and I really love living in this country very much so. But sometimes things frustrate me, and let me share with you. The other day I was on a train, and a poster caught my eye, and it said, 93.12% of all London overground trains run within five minutes of their schedule time between 28th of June 2015 to 12th July 2015. <laughs> Is this confession? <laughs> and Anise said, we are improving your journey on London overground. Are they apologizing? <laughs> Because I thought the trains are supposed to be running within zero minutes of their schedule time. <laughs> In Japan, trains are on time, like proper on time, on time. <laughs> so that morning, I was very tired. So even though it was in a rush hour, I couldn't stop myself. And I said to the poster, Out loud, <laughs> I forgive you. <laughs> because uh, as I said earlier, I really love living in this country because people are more laid back and relaxed than people back home. And there is one word, one beautiful English word I love. And we don't have this word in Japanese. It is ish <laughs> So I decided to bring this ish concept back home <laughs> So that last time when I visited my family I told my mom let's meet up at one ish <laughs> But because we don't have this word I said to her Let's meet up in between 105 and 125. <laughs> I saw her eyes <laughs> with confusion <laughs> and rage. <laughs> I believe that this ish culture began long time ago and it is in people's blood. That's why people are called British. <laughs> Thank you. So um, I leave you with this. Uh, the other day I was walking down the street and there was one very good looking young white English man said to me, Ni hao. Maybe some of you know this meaning. This means hello in Chinese. <laughs> but I thought it's quite nice because, you know, living in this modern society, no one really say hello to strangers on the street. So I said, hello, in Polish. <laughs> yeah, get it right, motherfucker. <laughs> You've been absolutely wonderful.